Hey up troops, welcome back to the Latana Army, I'm Lit and this is Fortnite Save the World and what I want to do today is check out this hero again, Quick Draw Calamity, because the last time we used her, we tried using like the Bald Eagle, we tried using like all different pistols like Zappy pistols and stuff like that, but one we didn't really use and one that you guys said in the comments a lot was to try using her with the Judge and you said that it may be a different experience if we tried to do that. So I'm all one for taking comments from you guys, I would love to see how this actually pans out. So let's just quickly go and look at the hero herself. So this is Quick Draw Calamity. Now, I'll not go over all the skills again. If you want to see that, I'll put the review in the top corner of this video so you guys can see it. But if you actually go down and we just have a look, she's a pistol specialist. The right up down at the bottom says a gunslinger who only needs six shots to get the job done. Now, if we go up here and just look at what kind of skill she's got. Now, she's got lefty righty on there, a lot like Raven if you've used him. Uh, you've also got debilitating shots, so it stacks vulnerability, dual debilitation, etc. War cry, which is great. Most soldiers with war cry, going to be great. Then you've got six shooters as well. So the first six rounds in a pistol magazine deal 12% increased damage and 24% increased impact. So that's pretty awesome. Lingering pain as well. She's also got, you know, that's that's a thing that's from the Urban Assault. So that should be a good skill. And that's something that on the Urban Assault works great. You've got going commando. I kind of wish that was frag grenades. That would have made a big difference to this character, I feel. You've also got the bottom two, which are six shooter ace. So increases six shooter damage by 12% and impact by 24%, and then fight or flight increases war cry damage by 10% and movement speed by 10%. Now, why is this important? So if we go over to the actual judge and we just have a look in here, now, this is a donated weapon. I cannot remember who donated this. So if you let me know in the comments down below, if it was you, I'll make sure that you get a note in the description as well. But what I've got on here, look, this is a crit build. So it's a crit rating, crit damage on there. You've got damage to mist monsters on there. You've got the water elemental damage on there as well. So that could be good. We're gonna go into a fire mission. So just to get the most out of this weapon and you've also got reload speed on there as well but the dueling crown for this is that it's only six shots so every time that the gun kind of runs out then you've got that now the good thing about quick draw calamity is she's actually got in a pinch so increase weapon reload speed by 35 percent if the magazine is empty so what happens is the magazine empties she gets 35 percent reload speed on there and then she gets the buffs that she gets from using the six shooter ace which is increases six shooter damage by 12 percent and impact damage by 24 so it's almost like this gun He's, he's perfectly tailor-made for quick draw calamity but we're gonna have a see so what we've got we've got power level 150 and didn't level this one all the way up just to come up to level 40 and the weapon itself i believe is a 106 let's just double check that there it is 106 so it's a 106 shadow shard what we're gonna do is just jump into a mission and see if she's any good on her own so we'll go solo first of all we'll just jump into a private game because this is a test and we're gonna see how she actually holds up against those power level 100 husks stay tuned Okay, so here we go then. I guess we start. So it's got six shots in it, this one, and each shot should be doing more damage than normal. How quick can we fire this? The fire rate is not too bad on it, but it, look at it, it's pretty much one-shotting most of these heroes down. Now, this is without war cry or anything on there. Just move around. Oh, ram. We've got the head explosion on there as well. So that's not too bad at all. Now, the heroes we've gone with, I've gone for Field Agent Rio on there. And I've also gone for First Shot Rio on there as well for the extended war cry in the tactical. But that was a little bit better. Oh, that's... Be oh, my God. Right, okay. This looks like it's going to be tough. So let's just get around the corner and just see what we can do. Let's land these headshots. The impact definitely works. I mean, look at that knockback. That taker's going to have to go first, right? Oh, wow, that aim, though. Oh, no. That is a level 100. So we've popped Warcry right now, then. Just for good measure. So we've got extended movement speed. Oh, damn it. We do not need him. All right, let's get around the edge. Got to use the map a little bit. All right, so all six shots are going to be having increased damage on there. I'm trying to land headshots where I can. Maybe I should have gone for the headhunter. The knockback kind of stops the blasters from firing, which is pretty cool. Okay, I think that's everything gone. <laughs> okay, so here we go. So we've got some more up here then. Don't forget, these are over the power level of this character. So, you know what? If this doesn't work, it doesn't work. We are going to drop down to a power level 94 very shortly. But I just wanted to basically just try it out first in the PL100. Alright, not bad. Okay, look, there's a smasher up there. So let's go and take him out and see what we can do with that. Okay, I'm definitely going to pop Warcry for this, I think. Alright, there we go. So here he is. So we're going to just empty the gun if we can. We're going to have to use the movement quite a bit. And we've got Warcry pops here, don't forget. 
Take out his friend. I mean, he does great on the little husks. They're just easy to take out. Can I, can I take the husky husk out through the little window thing? Nope, okay. <laughs> oh, I'm stuck! Okay, let's move. Where is he? Alright, so it's, it's okay, you know. Could do with a little bit faster firing, but that's actually not too bad. Let's try the husky husk. Alright, the impact's not really knocking this one back as much as what I think it should. Oh, alright, I tell a lie. Yes, it did. <laughs> Alright, so down he goes. That's not too bad at all. It's doable. It's achievable. You can work with this. The Judge definitely works better than what the other weapons did. Even like the Bald Eagle, which is a great gun. Probably one of, one of my favourite pistols. But, you know, I just don't think... I don't know. This hero needs some AoE. And I don't think the ones that she's got are really good enough. And lefty righty should be fantastic look. So this is lefty righty then, Pops. Let's see how many of these we can take out. It's hard to, like, be accurate with lefty righty, I think. It's a bit like the going commando skill. It's one of those that just could be better. That should be an easy wipeout. And I think like with Raven, he's got the explosive lefty righty and things like that. This hero just feels a little bit lacking all the time still. Okay, now to keep things fair, what I've done, I've dropped down to a power level 94 mission. Just to kind of, like I said, I do want to give her a fair run. Okay, so this is the dude. Accuracy is everything. <laughs> All right, let's fire this faster. Come on. Not yet All right, it's not bad. That's not bad. This is better. Okay, so we've got to be more accurate. You just get the extra reload speed if the clip's empty. But that was a little bit better. Okay, we've got a shield of husk here. Nice. Look at that. All right, now. <laughs> All right. and we've got a smasher as well. So let's have a try this out then. Okay, let's get out of the way. <laughs> Okay, let's pop war cry. Oh, that reload speed, though. That definitely was good. Okay, quick reload. All right, definitely better. If you stick to kind of your own level, it kind of works a little bit better. Now, I can run level, you know, PL100 missions at the level that I'm at. However, it definitely makes a difference if you stick it to our own level. Look, we've got another one here. Now, we had war cry up on the last one. So, let's do it without war cry. Let's just, uh, let's just see what we can do here. So I'm going to empty the gun as quick as I can into this smashing. Now, we're going to get a charge, I am sure. Not always great at getting rid of charges. I mean, little husks, it just takes out straight away. There we go. We're out the way of that one. Okay, quick reload. Empty that out while he just gets his breath. And good. I mean, I think if you use it at our own level with a gun like this, with the judge, it can make a huge difference. You guys that watch the channel regularly, I'm not a huge fan of of the going commando skill. I just don't feel that it's it's accurate enough. I don't feel, I feel it's too situational. I say that a lot in my videos. So it's not really a skill. I would have loved to see frag grenades on here instead. But let's just try this. Okay, I'm not the, I'm not the, <laughs> the best headshot person here. I'm not a headshot specialist. All right, we're using a water weapon on nature husk. So not the best test here. We're still gonna try it out anyway. Yeah, that's not doing a great deal. Propane. What's he doing with that? That's the worst throw ever. <laughs> yeah, you can definitely feel the knockback on it, though. It's got lots of impact on it. I mean, it puts things down pretty well. I do still find myself backing up, though, which I don't really like in Heroes. But maybe that's a Pistol Hero thing. I don't really use Pistol Heroes enough, maybe, to, for this to be like a... For that to be like a valid argument. Okay, so we've got lefty righty. you know. We've got... Going commando on there. So, do you know what? Let's try an encampment. Why not? Okay, quick reload. Okay. Oh, oh, damn it. Okay, that's messed everything up. I mean, look. This lefty right, it just feels so lackluster. Even when I'm playing at the right level, it just doesn't, doesn't quite feel right. I can't put my finger on why either. Okay, let's just move. Yep, he's going to charge. Oh, I was trying to get up the hill. Okay, so go and commando then. As I said, it is situational, and it's probably situations like this. Do you know what? You would max it out where you would use it. The situations do come up. Do you know what? That kind of works, I guess. I think this is the last guy. Is that it? Yeah, there it is. 
It just seems like <laughs> it just seems like the hard way to do things in this. Okay, so last mob then. So there's quite a few husks here of all different types. But let's have a look. Got the most resistant types to this weapon on this map, which doesn't help. But look, this is where this is where she actually falls down, I feel. If she starts getting swarmed, she kind of comes a bit unstuck. So she needs a lot of support. I mean, if you've got a good team and you've got a good hero in there, then this could work. And the accuracy just got to be so on point. Good range on the judge, though. I mean, you got to admit. So that's not too bad. Okay, war cry and a taker then. We'll make this the finish. The big finale. Single mist monsters, great. You know, not a problem at all. Even if that smashes, even if that's like, I don't know, do you know, smashes, blasters, um, takers, anything like that does absolutely fine. Okay. <laughs> Some minerals you just can't leave. And I saw just down the way, just over to the right, there's some sort of sunbeam or obsidian, I think. So we definitely need to go and get that. So see if I just creep over here, land them headshots, and I'm getting the, the increased impact and everything from there. So it's more than worth it. Okay then guys, so that was Quick Draw Calamity with the Judge. And we tried it on all different husks. We tried it on normal husks. Uh, we tried it on opposite nature husks. So, you know, we tried it on nature husks when we were using a water weapon. We tried it on fire husks, so we get the maximum from it. We tried it on blasters. We tried it on uh, mist monsters of all types. You know, we tried it on takers. It's kind of one of those, she's an, the hero's okay. The Judge definitely improves at 100%. If there's a weapon that was made for a hero, it's the Judge and Calamity. You know, them two just go together really, really well. The fact that it's got six shots in it, the Reload speed on this one that I was given is absolutely fantastic. You can definitely tell, you know, that it's it's a really good meld. You know, the synergy in this, synergy. Using synergy in a video, that's always going to be good. But you can tell that the synergy between these two is absolutely phenomenal. The only thing is still, she's still not a top tier hero. She's still very difficult to use. She's very hard to take out of the power level. So if you go, like, I'm power level 94, the power level 100 mission was probably a bit too much for that character. I felt like I was stretching that hero a little bit too far. But then when I dropped down to the power level 94 mission, a lot, lot better. I just wish that this hero had a little bit more wave clear on there. If we look at the skills here, you can see she's got lefty righty on there. She's got war cry and going commando. Now going commando, you could argue is an AOE skill. I just find it far too situational, especially for a hero like this. A quick frag grenade to the ground or even shockwave would be much, much more effective, I feel. And do you know what? I think if she had shockwave, you'd see a completely different hero because then she can put some distance between herself and then get the pistol back out and just clear them out using the judge. So these, these little tweaks, I think, I would love to see Epic Games Swap going commando for shockwave. That would be the that would be the best case scenario. Or the frag grenades because the, the frag grenades are more versatile because then you can start changing the tactical slot around to have like you know pulse grenades or you can start having like AOE grenades and things like that. And like I said, that just opens up more options. But guys, let me know what you think down in the comments below. You know, some people I know are really enjoying Quick Draw Calamity, and someone was telling me in the Discord that they've not used another hero since Quick Draw Calamity come out. Do you know is that what you're like? Are you someone who likes these kind of off meta heroes? You know me, guys. I really enjoy playing the game that I want to play the game. And I always implore you guys to do exactly the same. And I think, you know, Quick Shot Calamity is someone who's probably going to be a bit of a niche choice for a lot of people. You know, someone like the Bulletstorm Jonesy, someone like Ragnarok, who's not, you know, not seen as top meta, but definitely still seen as usable. But let me know what you're running, guys. I would love to know in the comments down below. I do read every single comment, so please make sure that you have your say in there as well. And if you're not part of the Latana army already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to drop that thumbs up as you leave, and I will catch you on the next video. Thanks for watching today, guys.